Today, we have an adorable dynamic duo. This is Wally, the 11-year-old Chihuahua and Pomeranian mix, and his sister Rogue, the one-year-old Akita and German Shepherd mix. Both Pomeranians and Shepherds are my favorite breeds, so this is going to be a fun appointment for me. Wally has collapsing trachea, which is the reason why I'm not using restraints around his neck during the bath and the blow dry today. Collapsing trachea is very common amongst Pomeranians as well as other small breed dogs. It's caused by incomplete formation or weakening of the cartilage rings of the trachea resulting in flattening of the trachea. The trachea is the tube that connects the throat to the lungs, and when it is collapsing, it makes it difficult for the dog to breathe. The most common sign is a persistent dry cough, often described as a goose honk cough. The cough may worsen from excitement or pressure, such as from a collar, or during hot and humid weather. It's advised for people who have dogs with collapsing trachea to not use collars and make sure that their dog remains a lean and healthy weight, as overweight dogs may struggle to breathe even more. To finish off Wally's blow dry, I placed him in the caddy shack back. He was moving around quite a bit on the table and I didn't want him to fall off. And since I can't use a grooming loop, the caddy shack back is the next best option. Before I finish Wally's haircut, I'm going to give Rogue her bath. This is her first professional grooming and she's doing very well. But Wally was still very concerned about his sister. Excuse me, sir. After her bath, I toweled her dry, and then I blow dried her with the high velocity dryer. If she was pure shepherd for her first groom, I'm sure she would have given me some trouble. But since she is half Akita, they are very calm, cool, and collected animals, and so she is taking her first experience very well. After she is dry, I de-shed her with the Equi Groomer, and then I clip her nails. Good girl. Good girl. Please don't let those. Good girl. To finish her off, I spray her down in our cranberry champagne cologne. Now it's time to finish Wally. To start his brush, I put a grooming loop on him just to see what his table manners are like. Once I realized that he will not try to jump off the table, I removed it for the remainder of his groom. After his brush, I give him a small scissor tidy using my chunkers. I clip his nails, and then I shave out his paw pads. I tidy up his Grinch feet, and then I spray him down in cologne, and Wally is all finished. It's so cute to see how much these two love each other. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this dynamic duo.